Amadou, thank you so much for joining us. Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank no, you. Come in, come hey. in, have a okay. chat. Okay, so four minutes on the clock. You go and get your first goal for your new club. But the celebrations at the end of the game with the fans <laughs> and that smile on your face, you look like you're enjoying this new life at Aston Villa. Tell us about it. Definitely. I think uh, it's an unbelievable start. I couldn't have had it any better. Uh, the fans were obviously fantastic tonight. I was, I was enjoying it. You could see it at the end. Um, the cross, as I said, was a 12 out of 10, so I couldn't miss it. Uh, unbelievable. Very delighted tonight. Amadou, you got your first goal. You only got two last season yep. for Everton. How much work do you do with Austin McPhee? I know you came over and shook his hand yes. after. How much work is done on set pieces? And just, just talk us through the goal. I'll see if we can run it here. Talk us through what, what your position was and the way that you were attacking that ball in, in the space. Right, so, um, well, I, I thought he was coming it's, on the screen. It might come oh, on the come. Oh, yeah. here it comes. There he goes. Comes. Yeah, so, this, is, this is something we, we work on a lot. Uh, obviously, mm -hmm. yesterday we were an hour on the, on the pitch working on this. You could see it. Brand, uh, Morgan was trying to create space for me, open it, took Suchek with him so that I can come in running. And obviously, you know, that's the, that's the, that's the, that's the money. <laughs> that is the money. <laughs> right, the money. Uh, it, it helps me when you can jump as high as you can. <laughs> we had a really good opportunity la last summer to uh, watch Unai Emery train his team. And he's been fantastic the way he does. Has it been something that you've enjoyed coming in and, and understanding? understanding how he operates? Definitely. I think, uh, I just said, his football IQ is on another level. Uh, I think he can definitely bring my game to the next level, uh, especially with the ball, on the ball, you know. Just his, his knowledge, I think uh, I can learn a lot with him. I'll just follow on from that, because thinking the same thing, you know, Everton, it was very different under Sean Dyche. How different? And give me some specifics about what this manager can do to improve your play from central midfield. I think he just gives you a lot of confidence. Uh, he, he believes in his, uh, you know, players' attributes and, 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 you know, the confidence he gives you is just unbelievable. You get out there, you know what you're doing, you know your task mm. with the ball, uh, without the ball. So you're not really worried. You're just playing automatically, kind of. And, uh, yeah, it's, you're it's just You're enjoying more having more possession in this team. Though, Definitely. Which... I think, uh, no disrespect, it's just a different type of football, yeah. you know. Uh, everyone has his, like I said, uh, type of football. But uh, I think this suits me a little bit better. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.